How can I protect my retirement in divorce? Hi, I'm Bill Farias, founder of Farias Family Law. I sat down with this gentleman about three weeks ago and he's in a five-year marriage, headed toward divorce, has a lot of uh, retirement assets and he's afraid that he's going to lose a big chunk of them in his divorce. So his question was, how do I protect myself? Well, unfortunately, if you do not have a prenuptial agreement, there is no foolproof way to uh, protect your retirement in divorce. I mean, even a prenup is not 100%, but it is the closest thing that you're go going to get to 100% in terms of protecting certain assets. Most people don't have a prenup. So if you do not have a prenup and you're headed toward divorce, then the court is going to consider a number of factors in determining how to divide your assets, including your retirement accounts. They're going to look at the length of the marriage, uh, the age of the parties, the income of the parties, their other assets, their contributions to the marriage, their health, uh, a number of factors. I think the most significant factor though is the length of the marriage. So the shorter your marriage, the more likely it is that the court is going to exclude your premarital assets. And in fact, if your marriage is really short, as in under a, a couple of years, there is a higher likelihood that the court will just send each party uh, their separate ways. Um, premarital cohabitation uh, is a factor. So if the parties were living together for a significant period of time before the marriage, that's also something that the court can consider. But generally, the, the shorter the marriage and the shorter the period of time that the parties were a financial unit, the more likely it is that you will keep most of your assets, especially the premarital assets. So another thing that you can do is once you figure out that you're getting divorced, you can stop contributing to your retirement accounts. Of course, that money will probably be going somewhere else as in uh, your bank account, and the money in your bank account can still be uh, considered for division, but if you want to sort of minimize uh, the size of that asset and minimize the amount of retirement at stake, you can always just stop uh, contributing. There is no rule that you have to continue to make contributions to your retirement account. So in terms of what you can do to protect your assets, you gotta have a prenup if you, if you want the optimal level of protection. If you don't have that, then there is going to be an analysis. And again, the shorter the marriage, the more likely it is that you are going to keep your premarital assets. And if the marriage is really short, the more likely it is that you may be able to walk away with uh, all of your assets. But that's only in very short marriages. So if you have any other questions about this, feel free to call us at 508-675-0464. You can email us at info at fariusfamilylaw.com. If you found this video helpful, feel free to subscribe to our channel and share it with anyone you think might benefit from it. And you can find us on Facebook at Farius Family Law and on Instagram at Farius Family Law. Thank you. Have a good day.